and welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm going to bring you a The Range haul. Um, it's a sparkly, a bit of a sparkly haul, lots of sparkles here. Um, I'm doing it away from cam because I think this will be harder to show this these sorts of pretty things um, when facing the camera. So I'm going to pull the stuff out. They're actually in my trolley. Ta-da! Um, so I'm going to do it bit by bit and one by one and uh yeah this should uh this should go well get to subscribe if you haven't already and give it a like if you do enjoy the video at the end also please if you feel you know you can leave comments down below if you need to um any constructive criticism any feedback videos that you want to see etc 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 so guys thank you all so much for coming back and uh let's dive right okay. in so the first thing i bought were these two beautiful uh posies um they are like a champagne pink color and they are just fabric but they come i don't know how many is in there one two three four five six seven seven posies in there seven flowers in a posy and they were just 2.99 i'm thinking i might use the heads as a diy um but but i might use it for something else i'm not too sure yet but i did buy two of those da -da, da -da. and yeah I'd, i was gonna buy the white ones but i thought no the champagne color is really pretty and um yeah they'll come in handy for something and they're already tied guys you could actually use these um for wedding posies for your bridesmaids you could probably jazz them up a bit with some um, diamante pins in the heads and some bling wrap around the uh, around the stems. They'd look really pretty. Um, so that was that. They're two ninety nine each, like I said. The next thing I got was for another DIY. I'm going to make one of those fancy flower boxes. Um, so I bought two packs of these foam roses. They are they were two seventy nine each and they've got the wires on them so you can use these in foam board or into um oasis what they call it and you know do your own little diy in there or you could actually take these out and just glue them down to stuff but i thought they're just they're actually really pretty when you look at them when i first see them i was like oh mm, i don't know but seeing them now they're actually really pretty so yeah, I bought two packs of those at two seventy nine dollars each. Uh, the next thing I got was, this is also from the wedding section. It's pink and rose gold, but I was thinking I might be able to change the ribbon to a black um, and put them in my kitchen. Because at Christmas, I always have like a rose gold runner that goes across our table to match all our copper stuff. And I thought this would be perfect. Um, I don't even know how much these were. I have the receipt here, so I'll let you know. But yeah, that's the rose gold bunting. And again, wedding section was absolutely amazing this time of year in the range. They two, were two ninety nine. They were so two ninety nine, and you get ten flags in each. So if you were decorating a hall, you probably wouldn't need much because they're really, really big. Like considering. But yeah, two ninety nine, fab buy. Um, the next thing I got was these crystals. I buy these every time I go to the range, just because they are so damn pretty. Two nineteen, they cost, and there is an abundance of them. A lot more than you get in the pound shop ones, and they're all big ones as well. Look how sparkly they look. How beautiful are those? So yeah, again, wedding section. But they also have these in the candle section because they look good with the candles. And talking of candles, look how gorgeous this goddamn tray is, guys. It's so sparkly and so beautiful. I just, oh my god, I, I couldn't stop looking at it. And um, yeah, I just had to get it. This was, I think, $6.99. Yeah, $6.99, guys, this was. And it is absolutely it's just bloody gorgeous, isn't it? And as you can see, it's got the crushed crystal, the fine crushed crystal around the edges. And these tea lights I already have from there, and they were one seventy nine each back then. Um, but they do have them on offer sometimes. So yeah, you could pick those up and probably make it yourself if you could find a plate 
to match. But yeah, I absolutely adore this and it's probably one of my favourite buys of the whole year. So yes, yeah, it's very pretty. And it's um, it's got the nice foam, not the, the velvet back with some feet on there. So you're not going to scratch any of your furniture with that on top. It is quite heavy as well. Really nicely made. So uh, the next thing I got was this soap pump. This was six ninety nine. I didn't realise it until I'd actually paid for it how much it was. There was only, I think there was a few left in the shop and um, they didn't have the actual uh, toothbrush holder or anything like that. This was actually in the bathroom section. But I'm thinking of using this as a vase. Um, I think it would look great as a vase. Let me, let me just show you what I mean. <laughs> Ta-da! And then watch this. It transforms into of ours because you could basically bling wrap or put some gems around the um the head and then you could fill it out a bit more with the flowers but i think look how pretty that looks now look how gorgeous that is i absolutely love it so yeah even if i don't use it as a soap pump i could use it as a little vase and have it on the same on the table with with that i think that looks really pretty don't you I do. Right, next things, let's go. Um, I got some glitter for some more DIYs. Guys, I'm gonna do a DIY season for you. Five weeks, six weeks of DIYs. I think I have a few lined up. So um, watch this space. Uh, this is the hollow glitter. As you can see, it's got the um, hollow graphic uh, sparkle in there. And this one is the plain flat glitter although still very sparkly and very beautiful. And look at the lids. How pretty are those? And I'm thinking these lids will come in handy for another DIY. I could actually use these as um, handles on something. It's a bit scratched, but, you know. I think they look... Oh, they look good as feet, actually. <gasps> Ooh! DIYs coming your way. So, yeah, they're by a Neo. New, nouveau sorry they're by nouveau and yeah they're pure sheen glitter and i think they'd work really well on glass and ceramics as well so it says use with nouveau glue pens whoops i don't have uh glue pens but the hey i got was this uh candle tray it came in the box which i'm really surprised about because the range don't usually put anything in boxes so i'm going to unbox this for you right now it was all bubble wrapped as well, which is really nice. Now I've got this from, I've got one from the, no, two from B&M. One is round and one is square. And now I have the rectangle one. Isn't this divine? Can you see that? Is that, look, it's got the big fat chunky crystals in there. And they still call this crushed crystal. I'm not sure why, because it's not crushed. It's just little gems, but, but it's so pretty so so pretty and I absolutely love everything like this absolutely love it and again it comes with the um, feet and the velvet back in so you're not going to scratch anything Don't want to put frames. This back there. so we've got I think that yeah eight by six and they've just got the bling wrap now I wasn't going to get these but then I remembered I when we went to Chesington a couple of weeks ago we got some photos of the kids and I thought these would go perfect in there so these were let's have a look bum, ba -da -bum, bum, bum, ba -da -bum, bum. crystal photo frame no that's the other one Esme frames they are 249 guys two pound fifty for these how bloody beautiful for two pound fifty and look how they sparkle really really pretty so I'm really happy with those for two pound fifty each and um, you can uh, probably get some command strips and hang those if you wanted to and just take off the um, the step, the stand. But yeah, I think they're really, really pretty. They'd also look nice as a tray. You could uh, DIY those into a tray. Ideas, ideas. <laughs> um, and the other two photo frames I got, they were 4 99 each. 
so a little bit more expensive but oh my goodness when you see them guys you're gonna freak just as much as i did especially if you love glitter look how beautiful it is i'm just gonna stand that up here oh my goodness look at that you see my slippers <laughs> um but yeah it's uh 10 by 15 which i think is a four to six four by six and um yeah you can see all the shit in the background over there yep i'll show you it's just the kids slippers because i hoovered up the uh door area there um but yeah absolutely stunning photo frames and like i said i've got two of those because they are magnificent absolute magnificent and on the same if i was to have them on my bedside table look how beautiful that all looks together such a beautiful range and do you know what i'm absolutely completely obsessed obsessed with it um so yeah anyway <laughs> before i blabber on and gush about crushed crystal um i'm gonna show you the last thing because it's my favorite item well Okay, that was my favourite item. But I found these, some Chanel Chunky Yarn and the hand knitting, um, arm knitting, sorry, Twisted Chunky Yarn. Uh, these were on offer at £3.99, I think, from 6 I think they knocked down from 6 99 Not too sure. Uh, let's have a look. Oh, yeah, it was 3 99 each, but they were on offer, so I thought, why not? Let's rip this open. Oh my god, it's so soft! But I thought I could try some either some wall hangings with these or try my hand at making like a little cushion or something because I found that two rolls won't be enough. You need like at least ten to make a whole blanket. So yeah, I'm I'm happy with the colours. They had this in the, the grey, but it was dark grey, and obviously my flat is uh silver so i didn't want to go too dark but yeah 3.99 for these and they still have them in they had an abundance of them in the surrey keys store so if you do live close then go get them while while they're still there so yeah the last thing guys oh my goodness this little box makes me so happy i'm gonna pull it out now Ta -da, there it comes <laughs> hello little box so yeah, this is the Crushed Crystal two draw jewelry box. And they did have a free draw one and it was a two pounds more. So not too bad, but I just thought I don't have that much space. So here it is, all covered and well packaged. Oh my goodness. Do you know what? Every time I look at this, I'm like, oh, I've got it out so many times and had a look at it. And I've been dying to film this haul so I can go put it out in my bedroom. But look. Oh my god, it's so pretty. And for, what did I say it was? $7.99? $8.99. Crystal, to, yeah, the crystal jewellery box um, is here. Two, two draw jewellery box, $8.99. Now, for a present, how beautiful would this be? Because you can set little things on top. If you had like some little cute perfume bottles and stuff. But why would you want to cover that? It's so beautiful. And I know it's all cheaply made, guys. But look how stunning it all looks. And these drawers are, um, they come fully out. And um, like, yeah, they're all velvet covered. And they're really light as well. It's literally just that glass panel at the front. So I would be careful with those um, if you've got zealous kids around like my own um but yeah i think it's an absolute beautiful buy and it's mirrored all the way around as well so there's no hidden um hidden bits there but oh god it's just lovely and yeah like i said when it's all set out and you've got all your bits and bobs look how stunning that whole range is oh i love the range thank you so much for making me so happy um yeah guys that is it that is what i bought and i'm absolutely thrilled to bits with all those pretty things look at it just absolutely stunning
But yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. And um, I will see you in my next video. I hope you enjoyed this video. So please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And yeah, we'll talk soon. Take care, guys. Happy tubing. Bye.